In the meantime, the chairman of the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, NDLEA, Brigadier General Bubamawa, has commissioned a newly built multi-purpose clinic and rehabilitation center in Obomasho, or your state. Our correspondent, John Alabi, completes the story as presented from our studio. The 16-bed rehabilitation center named the Behavioral Action Care Foundation Center was built by a group of indigents of Ugbumosho. It is their first community initiative, otherwise known as All First Group, as part of their efforts to stem the dangerous tide of drug abuse in the area. The board chairman of the group, Bayo Babatunde, said, apart from primary reason, the large presence of immigrants from Ghana, Niger, Benin, India are also part of the reasons for the high incidence of the menace. And in our towns and cities, drugs has become a major problem in order to curb this menace. This menace which is potentially damaging to the lives of the resource of this state, which is the young men and women that we hope will live to fulfill their potential to the fullest. Bubu Marwa, in his speech, calls on parents and caregivers to study their words behaviors as he maintained that 14.4% of Nigerians' population are on drugs and Southwest is 23.4% of the drugs victims, while Oyo State covers 22% of the Southwest quota. The NDLEA boss, while calling for collaboration with stakeholders, said the agency will continue to ensure crackdown on all sources of illicit drugs wherever they are used, planted, or being sold. The chief of staff to Oya State Governor lords the rationale behind the construction of the building. It's not something easy because people, people don't want to accept the fact that they have problems. Parents are shy to come out to say their children have problems, they think it's uh, you know, a problem. That we need to quickly start. If we don't if we don't tackle this problem, this problem will consume us. We are facing a drug challenge in Nigeria, but it is a solvable challenge. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.